What giggity good bizarre vlog 159 in the building, you feel me? It's a boy trip bizarre. So basically, you know, um I'm going to have to be a little bit more creative in the month of December because you know, I want to have an actual studio where I record my own stuff so I can have a whole setup, you feel me? Because I just left from my place and y'all know I had that big old room, you feel me? And like, I was just able to record as much as I want to, even though it was small, you know, I was complaining about that, you feel me? But you feel me? It had, a, you know, but you know, when you out in Cali, you know, you pretty much have to have like a studio, a creative space or something. Because you don't want to just be playing music super loud and stuff. Like, they'll call folks on you, like, the same day, like, you know, like, in 10 seconds. You feel me? Like, so, I'm not even going to go there. You feel me? I'm not even starting there. I'm not even going to come out with nothing. You feel me? So, <clears throat> if I do something, it's going to be probably like this, probably, or something like low-key or something. Or maybe I'll go out somewhere and do something. But I'm going to get my car Sunday, so... Maybe I'll go to the beach or something and do like a beach vlog or something, you feel me? And I can be out there talking as much as I want to, you know, you feel me? But I'm going to get my car Sunday, hopefully. They said around 3 to 4 o'clock, you feel me? That's great news because, you know, I'm playing, I'm sorry, but, you know, I just took my hair out and it's like real sensitive, you feel me? So I'll be scratching it because, like, um, it's not sensitive, like it hurts, it's just like, I ain't used to have my hair out, and I'm trying to, like, make sure it's not, like, you know, like, um, messed up, you feel me? Because, you know, we never know. But there's neither here nor there. You know, I am bait. That's why I was doing that, not because I was really doing that for a reason, you feel me? But, um, besides that, I mean, we had the two-minute boner, I mean... Oh, I'll talk about some gaming stuff, whatever. All right, so, um, so Cyberpunk, man. Man, they just starting to look kind of cool, you feel me? Because they got the soundtrack, you feel me? Because I was watching some, um, some videos on it. And they got some nice soundtrack, you feel me? They got the nice soundtrack. And then they got, um, like, all the customization stuff is trash, you feel me? I don't care about that, but... I feel like maybe the story is really good, you feel me? Maybe the side quest is very good, you feel me? But for me, I feel like, you know, it's going to have to be a $40 boner, you know, thirty nine ninety nine. you know, you know. I don't think they're going to do that, though. You know, they still haven't came out with the PS5 update version, so, you know, I'm not even, like, pressed to even play it, like, why am I going to play a backwards compatible game that just came out? I don't understand. You know, why y'all push it back so much if y'all just going to sit there and not even have the next gen update? Y'all push it back. We're going to make sure everything's optimized for every system across the board. It come out, Glitch City. What are we doing? You know, like, what did y'all even work on? You know, that, you know, it's the same thing. Like, I feel like they should just hire me to just go to different places and just look at the job environment. You know, I'm not going to tell everybody about it. But just like, man, you know, the last 15 games we done came out with, I'm not talking about Madden, but, you know, we'll say, let's talk about something a little bit less drastic. The last two games we done came out with has been trash, you know. Let's this time maybe get somebody in from an outside perspective to see what's going on, you feel me? You know, bring me in, you feel me? I might have a little team with me, you feel me? But, like, we just go sit down and, and, you know, see what's going on, you feel me? And, you know, we might not, you know, tell everybody what's going on. We just go take notes, you feel me? And then we just, you know, go to the boss be like, hey, man, so-and-so, so-and-so, so-and-so on this team ain't doing nothing. We know it because we have this amount of YouTube videos from different places. And then we got the commenters all agreeing. That's over 50,000 commenters right there. These guys ain't even doing it besides drinking coffee, telling dirty jokes at the water cooler. Get these guys out of here. You feel me? Like, that kind of stuff really ruins games, you feel me? But, you know, <clears throat> I think Cyberpunk was going through that. One of the guys had to quit because he was, like, sexually harassing everybody, and he quit. But then he tried to act like it was due to the game being trash. But then the women came out and it's like, nah, this man had some cases before he quit, you feel me? 
So like it's everywhere, you know, every industry, you know, but like in the game industry, like man, folks be just taking it. Like this is supposed to be for us, bro. We the one that got y'all here. We saved gaming, you know what I'm saying? When we was kids, you know, playing it, you know, and now they acting like, you know, they can just do whatever. Charge us seventy dollars, come out with BS products, Godfall. You know, they act like they can just, you know, come out with a half bay game, Call of Duty, you feel me, Cold War, uh, a sex creed by holler. You feel me? Like, what are we doing? Are we serious? And then they got, you know, they they talking about they push Halo Infinite back to the fall of next year. So I guess I won't be getting the Xbox until then. You know, I may get one in the summer, but I'm not pressed. You know, maybe if they drop a, like, a next-gen controller, you know, and then say, like, you know, we're going to actually update some stuff, you know, update some games, you feel me? But, like, they ain't saying none of that stuff. They just still trying to, you know, play the game, you know. Like, they're not trying to, like, you know, help the gamers out, you feel me? So... That's why I stand that with that, you feel me? We done made it up to a six minute bonus, but y'all can't, hey, bruh. What the lady say, bruh? Six minutes is good enough for me, you feel me? So, hey, if it's too much for y'all, nigga, y'all better go holler at these bitches, you feel me? Because, goddammit, that's all I got, you feel me? Thank you guys for watching. It's your boy Triple Zara, and I'm out.